Yes, again. Again, again, Friday night. I like my happy face. Five o'clock. Let's work out. We have a very, very long imam today. Yes, we 20 do. minutes. Steph, what are we going to do? We're going, going to do a lot. Box jumps, box step ups, push ups, thrusters, and body rows. Nice. So we I'm need so glad you're going to do this, not me. <laughs> I'm just going to stand there and scream to you. So, um, guys, we need some equipment. Um, if you have a suspension trainer, you can use that one. Otherwise, an elastic band will work or dumbbells. Um, we need a kettlebell, dumbbells, or backpack, and a box or a chair. Yeah, where you can step on or jump on. Before we cue the music, we have to say this Sunday, 12 15, Renato is giving an online Zoom class about strength, strength training. Uh, he's going to answer all of your questions regarding training, nutrition, I guess, recovery. I'm not really sure what it's going to do actually. No. Strength, mostly. Mostly strength. strength yes. And it's going to be more of a QA and more of a lecture than training. So you can just zoom in in your bathrobe sitting on your balcony and then join the class i'm going to join if i have to yeah I, I might join as well yeah so cool before we start let's cue the music here we go <laughs> Yes. Okay. The workout of today is a 20 minute MRAP of first minute box jumps or step ups. Then you do a minute of push ups, a minute of thrusters, and a minute of body rows. Each minute, oh, last minute is rest, by the way. So we do four rounds, five different uh, exercises. Oh, well, the fifth minute four. is nothing. Um, and each minute is an MRAP. So you're going to work hard um, and long as well. Depends on your speed. Depends on your <laughs> speed, yeah. Depends on your speed. You can do as much as you like, actually. Uh, so if you're halfway and you're like, well, I'm done with my trusters now, we cannot see you. No, but that's, that's up to you. That's the worst the <laughs> advice I've ever heard. Seriously. <laughs> just go, just go. I'm going to keep her going. Yeah, yeah, yeah better absolutely. idea. <laughs> um, to warm up, we're going to do two sets twice. First set is going to be step ups, squats, shoulder taps, plank shoulder taps, and mountain climbers. Second set is going to be box jumps, push ups, thrusters, and body rows. Well, that's a lot actually. So we're gonna demo the first round first. We're gonna do it twice. Then we're gonna demo the second round and we're gonna do, uh, do that twice as well. Yeah. All right? Cool. So f the first two rounds is going to be eight step ups. You need your box or your stool or your chair, or your whatever it is you're going to do your box, box step-ups on. What's a stool? A stool is... <laughs> That's uh, a Dutch word for chair, right? Oh, yeah. Well, Stool's more like, okay, just I'm go. not going to tell you. Give me eight. <laughs> One foot on, step by with your other feet, your other foot, extend all the way, and step back off. You're going to do this for eight reps. Then we're going to do eight air squats. Feet underneath the shoulders, toes slightly out. You're fully extended, sit back and down, Chest is up, knees are out, and back up. 10 of those. Then we're going to do 10 plank shoulder taps. So I want you to stand in your plank position, hand underneath the shoulders, press the floor away, tuck the hips in, squeeze your glutes, and from here you're going to tap your shoulders, opposite shoulders, or at the same side, whatever you like. Then you stay in your plank, because we're going to do, stay there, we're going to do mountain climbers. Knee to your elbow at one side and then the other side and then a little quicker, please. Ten of those. That, those are all your movements. We're going to start with the step ups and we're going to do two rounds in total. Yes, eight step ups. Let's go. All the way on, all the way up. You can alternate with your steps. Make sure your hips and shoulders are coming up at the same speed, so your hips don't shoot up first. Once you've done eight in total, you do eight squats. Sit back and down, chest is up. If you need to, sit your arms out, 
do eight. And once you've done eight, you're gonna go into your plank and you do eight, sorry, 10 plank shoulder cups. Make sure that hip is as high as your shoulders, not higher, not lower. Into 10 mountain climbers. And once you're done, you do the whole thing again. So eight step ups. In the workout, you can do, ooh. <laughs> don't triple, don't fall. Keep it safe. Did you know most accidents ha happen indoors at home? <laughs> we just had one, almost. <laughs> Be careful. We want you to work hard, but in a safe way. Yes, eight squats, let's go. Sit up straight, knees are out in line with your toes. Into 10 plank shoulder taps. And once you're done, give us 10 of those mountain climbers. Good. That was warm up number one. We're gonna do a second one. Um, with mostly movements that we do in the workout as well. We're gonna do box jumps, we're gonna do push-ups, we're gonna do thrusters. For those you need your weight, it can be a backpack, dumbbells, uh, kettlebell. Steph, what do you have today? Anything. Anything. <laughs> you have everything. Cool, nice. Yeah. Um, and some body rows. Yeah. That's where you need your suspension trainer for. Um, we do seven reps on each movement and we do the full thing twice. We're gonna show everything first. So for the box jumps, you stand in front of your, well, box. Hips go back, hands go back, jump up and extend fully. I'm scared to, that I jump over the headstand. Yeah, don't jump over <laughs> your box. Please don't do that. Into seven push-ups. I'm gonna show them. As well, hands underneath the shoulder in a plank position. Hips and shoulders go down at the same time. You touch the floor or the incline, if you use an incline, and you press up. Make sure your glutes and abs are tight. If you use an incline, bring it to the lower part of your ribcage or your belly. Yeah, so it touches in here. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Then we do seven thrusters. Thruster is a combination of a squat and a press. One fluid motion, in this case with two dumbbells. You sit back and down into your squat, you come up and you press out. And we're gonna do seven of those. Nice. Yes, <laughs> lovely. And then we do body rows. I'm gonna stand over here. With your suspension trainer, or if you have a pair of rings, you can put your feet underneath the rings or a little further if you wanna make it heavier or a little more back if you wanna make it easier. You be in one line, squeeze your abs, squeeze your glutes, chest is up, and you pull towards the chest, elbows next to your rib cage. And you do seven of those. Right. If you don't have a suspension trainer? You can do bent over rows with your dumbbells, or with your kettlebell, or with your weight. Yeah, then, one. this is your movement. One or two arms, everything uh, is yeah. possible. Yeah. Stand with the feet underneath the hips. You push the hips back, unlock the knees, chest is up, like in your deadlift. Hands or, or arms are hanging next to your body. From here you pull your, el your elbows next to your rib cage and the weight towards your belly. Or with one. Or with one can be done as well. Make sure your back is straight, tension on the hammies. Then you have kind of like the same movement as the body row. Um, I think we're good. <laughs> you are good. I am good. <laughs> Two rounds of seven box jumps, seven push-ups, seven thrusters, seven body rows. Let's go. And if, you're, if you cannot do box jumps now for any reason, um, do box step-ups. That's also an option for the workout. So if you have anything unstable, uh, you're not, you you're not, don't dare to jump on, just step on. That's fine. Then seven push-ups. Hands underneath the shoulders, 
squeeze the glutes, squeeze your core, chest comes down, hips come down, both touch the floor, and you press out. So much fun. Give a set. Yes, into seven thrusters. Thrusters, weight on your shoulders or in front of your chest, elbows are up, sit back and down, and when you stand up, last bit, you accelerate from the hips and you push those weights above your head. Seven thrusters. <laughs> Into seven body rows. This is already intense. It's only a warm up. Cool. <laughs> Chest up. Make sure you squeeze the shoulders back and down. Shoulder blades together during the full movement. Yes, Ooh. that was round number one, right? <laughs> or did I miscount? Let's do another one. Seven box jumps. And on your box, extend all the way for your box jumps, but also for your step ups. Don't be lazy. Into seven push-ups. If you're doing them on the floor, I want you to do them as pretty as Seb is doing now. You don't have to do seven. Unbroken can be two and two and two and one if you want to, or three and four, whatever works. Trusters, there we go. So much fun. Into seven body rows. Let's go. Can you imagine doing this for 20 minutes? <laughs> Thanks, Kat. Yeah. Thanks. Kat does all the online programming. Yes. Yes. That was fun, wasn't it? It Look, looked like fun. Shall we do this for 20 minutes? 20 minutes. Yes. So what we do is we're going to work for 20 minutes. Each minute you take another exercise. We do box jumps or step ups in the first minute for as many as you can. After the first minute, we move on into the second. We do push-ups as many as you can. Make sure they're pretty. If you feel like, or if you feel that your shoulders are coming up, but your hips are not, uh, you're doing some sort of a snake movement, stop, shake out your arms, start over again, or get an incline. So do them on a, on a bench or on your box or whatever it is you want to use. Third minute is thrusters, as many as you can and then body rows. As many as you can means as many as you can. Not, you not that you have to squeeze 100 into one minute. If five is all you can do within one minute, that's fine. All right? So that's what we're gonna do. I want you to do more, you know that. Fifth minute is rest. And we rest as hard as we can. So grab your sip of water, sit on your balcony, enjoy your, your little holiday, because then we're going to do the next four minutes. 20 in total, or actually 19, because last minute is rest. Oh, it's only 19 minutes. It's less than 19, less than 19 minutes. Yeah, it's, it's actually less than 90 minutes. Yeah. So I say let's it's go. 16 minutes. It's only 16 minutes. Let's go, 10 seconds. We start off with box jumps or with Box step ups. We go in three, in two, one, let's go. Find your pace. If you burn out in the first minute because you did 50 box jumps, that's not gonna work. Take it slowly, maybe accelerate during the workout or once we're approaching the end. Um, but that now, take it easy, find your pace. 
try to relax. There's a lot of work coming up. Twenty seconds. Try to land in the middle of your box. Your box jumps not on the side. Because if you slip, that's gonna hurt. Second minute, we do push-ups. There we go. <laughs> Take your time. Take out your arms. Do it again. And stop before your arms are set apart. Otherwise, you're done. 25 seconds. And then we move on to the thrust. dumbbells or your kettlebell. You do this with a kettlebell it's in front of your chest. Otherwise, you have dumbbells. You front drag so on your shoulders, elbows in front. Sit back and down into your squat. Knees are out. Sit up straight. Come up and press out. Bring the dumbbells back to your shoulders. Sit back and down into your next thruster. So much fun. This brings up the heart rate big time. But after this, we do body rows so you can bring it down again. 26 seconds left. Leg step, like this. Good, good, good. 14 seconds, 12. You need to stop, stop, otherwise push it a little further. We're done in three, in two, one and there we go with the body rows. Try to move as pretty as you can even when you're fatigued, even when you have a high heart rate, when you're out of breath. Make sure to squeeze your glutes, squeeze your abs, your midline is tight, shoulders are back and down, bring your shoulder blades together and pull. Pull, pull, pull! Come on Steph! 30 seconds left. Make sure you don't burn out. Not yet. We'll get there. Thank you. Twelve seconds and then we rest. Ten. Last rows. Come on. Up. Yes, nice. Three, two. One. Oh, that looks lovely. <laughs> it's only arms, right? Well, except for the, for the box jump. Nice. Upper body pump. Kind of be ready. <laughs> okay, guys, last sip of water. Ten seconds, and then we go again. Again, we do push, uh, box jumps or step ups, and then push ups, thrusters, and body rows, and then we rest again. Everything for one minute. Let's go. Box jumps or step ups. Jump in the middle of your box. Make sure your heels are on it as well. 
so you don't slip. Extend all the way. And be focused on this. With all the other movements, your mind can be everywhere. Here, your mind is at the spot where you're jumping on. Focus, focus. 15 seconds left. You want to rest? Take a bit of rest. Push ups. We go in three seconds. Have fun. Let's go. And guys, if you are fatiguing, if your arms are done, if you feel your midline is giving in, grab your incline. Just like in class, don't be stub stubborn. If you can move this pretty, do them somewhere else. Next step. Shake out your arms. Half a minute left. That's at least 15 push-ups. I did 13. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. 15 seconds. Next station is thrusters. Are we going two? In one, let's go. Looking good, feeling great. Keep on going. Keep squatting to the same depth. No half reps. We don't do push presses, we do thrusters. So full squat into a press. 30 seconds, halfway, then we do a set of rows and then we're halfway through the workout. 20, a little less than 20 seconds, 15, Let's go. Body ropes. Stephanie's doing a super hard variation with her feet very far away from the rings. If you want to make it easier, put your feet underneath the rings or a little more back so you come into a more vertical position. That makes it a lot easier. In every variation that you do, you are in one line, like in plank. Hips and shoulders are moving at the same time. Pull your chest up, shoulders down, and row towards your chest. We have eight seconds left, and then we rest for a minute. Two, one, yes, minute number 10, second minute of rest. So much fun. I can make a dance. Yeah, do a dance. <laughs> Maybe we should do that for a cool dance. Yeah. Dance. Dancing without music. They have music. They have music. We, <laughs> but we don't know which music. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, this is good. I cannot, I can barely speak. I'm so looking forward to the class that I'm about to do. <laughs> <laughs> no one will, will be able to speak. Thirteen seconds and then we go again. We start again with the box jumps or the step ups. Then push-ups, then thrusters, then body rows. Everything for one minute and then we rest again. Let's go. Box jumps. Or step-ups. Whatever you do, stand all the way. Looking good, 
70. 40 seconds left. See if you can keep on working for the full minute. We'll bring Where down the pace reps. just a little bit. Hmm? Where he can't reps. Yeah. Just like I do. 20 seconds. Done. Oh no, then we do push ups. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. In three, in two, one. Let's push up. Keep your elbows close. Don't let them flare out. And make sure your body is moving in one straight line. Do them on the floor, all the way down, all the way up. Lock your elbows out. Thirty-five seconds. Twenty seconds left. Nearly done. And then we move on to the thrusters again. 15 seconds. Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Grab your weight into your squat and go, 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 go. Thrusters. Maybe don't count your reps, just go. Keep on going. Looking good. That's it. My arms. <laughs> your arms are burning right. That's what we want. Nice. Nice. That's it. That's it. 20 seconds. And then we do body rows. And then we rest again. And that will be round number three. Then we only have one last round. Shake out your arms. I was about to say, okay, my, my demo girl just went away, but she's still with us. Let's go. Body rows. Let's go, let's go. And if you're at home and you did, you came till here and you feel like quitting, don't. Keep on going. We want you to keep on going. If things get hard, toughen up. I know that's easy to say them now. But keep on going. As many body rows as you can with good form. And remember, it's a pull. Don't throw in your hips. Use your back, use your arms. <laughs> 12 seconds, and then we rest again. Come on, Steph. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Two, one, and rest. You look like you have fun. My arms are killing me. <laughs> I, I had two reps less. Mm -hmm. And on this one, three reps. So. You count your reps. Yes, this I do. 20 box jumps, 13 push ups, 20 thrusters, and I did 15 body rows. Uh, That's good. Now it was 18 thrusters and 12 body rows. Oh, yay. Well, then, last round, I want you to push it. This Just like you guys. Yeah. I don't think I can go faster. Go a little faster in the last round. <laughs> you have to push a little more. If you still have some, some in your engine or some, uh, some gas left, let's go. Let's go. This is a preview. Rest hard, work hard. 10 seconds and then we do the last round. We go in six, in five. We do box jumps in three, in two, one. Last round, there we go. Nice, 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 that's it. Don't stop, keep on working, keep on working. Come on. 
Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Almost halfway. 30 seconds left. Half a minute and then you're done with the box jumps. You're done with the step ups for today. Check box, box jumps. Ding. Done. 20 seconds. Well, you're down in 10, in nine. We do push-ups in three, in two, one. Let's go. Last round of push-ups. As many as you can. 50 seconds left. Break up when you need to. If your arms are giving in, shake them out. Come onto your knees. And go again. Like your step. Make guess. 30 seconds of push-ups. Twenty seconds of push-ups. Keep it going. Keep it going. Fifteen. 10 seconds and then we move on to the thrusters, last set of thrusters. Three, two, one. Grab your weight onto your shoulders or in front of your chest. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice, that's it. Twenty seconds in, forty seconds to go. Yes, half a minute. That's it. Keep it going. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Twenty. That's it. Yes, yes, yes. Fifteen. Thrusters are almost done. 10, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Last exercise, ladies and gentlemen, body rows or bent over rows if you do this with your dumbbells. As many as you can for the last minute. And then we're done for today. With the workout at least. 45 seconds. Come up, Steph. I'm dying. Why? That's it. That's it. Looking good. Feeling great. Half a minute. Yes. Yes. 14 seconds. Ten. Final pulls. We're done in three, in two, one. That was it, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Hi, hi. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> my head is exploding. Your head is exploding. Oh my god. How about your arms? As well. Everything is exploding. Yeah, it was a lot of arms. Box jumps were easy. Box jumps were, were Push ups were okay. Yeah. Thrusters were killing me and the body rows. But that's normal because first you do push ups, then your arms are sore, and then you need to do an all um, compound. Thrusters exercise. and body rows. Yeah. So this was actually arms workout. Arm workout. Okay. Good there job, goes min minute number 20. I need you still to catch alive? My breath. Grab your sip of water. I'm alive, but my breath is still really high. Well, try to <sighs> relax a little bit. Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth, and maybe we do a little stretching. Shall we? Yeah. You want to do arms? 
Yes, please. Okay. <laughs> yes, please. Yes, please. Okay. Let's go. Should we move this? Yeah, sure. <laughs> so we have more One space. person job, right? Since we have Corona. <laughs> it sounds like you and I have Corona. No, we, we do. That's why the rest of the box is empty. You drink Corona. I do. <laughs> okay, guys. Shall we sit on hands and knees? Shall I do the first one so you can relax? Yes, please. And then maybe uh, <laughs> if you come up with something. Elbows on the floor. And now you put your hands in your neck. And then you're gonna sit back. So hip is high. I'm gonna come up here. Yeah. I'm gonna come out. You stay there, hip is high. See how far you can push the chest towards the floor. And this you feel in your upper back and your triceps as well. And maybe somewhere else, depends on uh, how flexible you are, how mobile you are, how sore you are. Yes, maybe extend your arms in front of you. Do the same thing. Try to breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Try to relax. Great. Sit back to your heels. Come out of this position. And you bring one arm in front of your chest. Grab your elbow with the other one and squeeze it against your chest. And then we do the other side. I'm glad there's wind outside. So I can go outside and just... Ooh, the sun's out now. Relax a bit, yeah. For workouts, the temperature is better than yesterday. Probably better than this morning as well. Good yeah. morning. The weather and but it was cloudy so yeah right okay shall we do wrists yeah sure okay um what we're going to do is we're gonna let our fingertips facing our knees so we're gonna rotate our hands fingertips are facing our knees and then from here we are going to lean back but be aware elbows should be straight This can be quite painful though, so maybe so if, if it does, don't sit back too much. Yeah, just what, do whatever you can. In the second round, I became nauseous. Oh, really? And I am still. <laughs> Okay, come slowly out of position. Now we are going to put the other side of our hands on the ground. So that means this side we should put on the ground. First lean forward, try to fully bring the hand on the ground. Try to keep your elbows straight if that's possible and then slightly lean backwards. Do whatever you can, don't overdo this stretch because this can be really painful on your wrists or your underarms. I always feel this. Yeah. A lot on my wrists. So I'm not sitting back to my uh, to my heels because that's too painful. And from here, we are going to try to make a fist, and then relax again, and again make a fist, and relax, fist, and relax. Three more, fist, and relax, fist, 
and your legs one more fist and relax and come slowly out of position and then put your hands in each other and then make small rotations i cannot do this fast now no need to right sorry no need to no no not at all Okay, we're going to do one more. I really would like to do the seal stretch for, un for your lower back. So come and lay down on your belly. Um, you, can do it in one, uh, you can do it with the hands on the ground or with your elbows on the ground. Um, hands is more stretched than the elbows. I'm going to do it on my hands. So come on your hands and come up into a seal position. Take Take a deep breath in and out, relax. This is not only lower back, but also stretching your abdominals. Yeah, I feel the stretch in my belly. Yeah, me too. <laughs> what, hap what happens when people um, are sitting on a chair behind their desk for a while? Um, the abdomen uh, is getting shorter and shorter. So then you see a lot of people with lower back pain. So this is a really good stretch if you have lower back pain, but don't overdo this stretch um, to create more length on the muscle of your abdomen. And come slowly out of position and then you can come and sit down on your butt. One leg will be straight, the other one will be bent and you put it over the other one, over your, your leg, grab your knee and then pull it to the other shoulder. So this is for the viewers, this is my left knee and I pull it to my right shoulder. And for me, it's my right knee. <laughs> And this is a really good glute stretch. Don't lean in your lower back, but try to sit up straight. Keep breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. And let's switch sides. So again, sit up straight. You feel more stretch if you sit up straight. Always when you're done with workouts, I'm always really glad I did it. But at the moment <laughs> you're doing that workout, it's like killing you. And your brain starts to kick, kick, kick in and it's like, I want to quit, I want to quit. And then your coach says, no, go on. <laughs> okay, relax guys. That is guys. what we're here for. <laughs> Come out of position and then we're done for today. So. Yes. Gonna, he has to do his shoelaces. <laughs> I have to do my shoelaces. From all the hard work that I just did. Okay, guys, we're done. So, again, for the people that didn't watch this video from the beginning on, Sunday, Renato's workshop. Join, guys. And then we will see you next week. Yes. Or outdoor. In class. Yeah. We have a different schedule for live streams, so if you would like to follow or live stream, then you can check the program on the yeah. CrossFit on the app. app. Yeah? So for now, shall we do some clapping? Let's do three Let's claps see. on three. One, two, three. Good job, guys. Bye bye. See ya.
Thank you.